how to make pretty good graphics with AI, some of which don't suck. I'm Brian. Welcome to my Tesla weekend. So first of all, this is not a live stream. I am not live. I am pre-taped, but I am in the chat. This is a premiere going live on my Tesla Live, the second channel. Or maybe you're watching a condensed version over the weekend on My Tesla Weekend. Either way, it's whichever one you see on the screen right now. This is, by the way, the second time I'm trying to record this because the first time <laughs> my mic was all crunchy and I had to reboot my microphone. So nightcafe.studio. That's the URL, nightcafe.studio. This is not a sponsor. This is just a site my kids found uh, that they had a lot of fun with creating random stuff. This image you see here, this looks like a car, but a double car, but a triple car. You can create your own images. You can make images from other images. And it's got a few different AIs it runs. It is free, but you should put that in quotation fingers because it'll give you five credits a day, which is enough to do some creations. Uh, but what I do is I just keep every day clicking on the five free credits and then I uh, save them up, use them later. So let's get into the account and see what they've got. Stable Diffusion, most popular. It's what I generally use with good luck. Dolly 2, mm, I don't think it actually is Dolly 2 because I've seen some videos about Dolly 2 and they're amazing and mine do not come out that well. But we will try an experiment with it and see what we get. And then they've got some older ones, Coherent, Artistic, and Style Transfer, which is what I use to make the merch for this channel. I'll, I'll, you know what? We'll go into what I already created. Because again, I already made this video once. The one I did for the video was Really Fast Car Drag Racing at Sunset. And it gave me these. These are quite good. Really Fast Car Drag Racing at Sunset in Stable Diffusion. That's... If you needed a thumbnail, this one's good. These are okay, but, and I like to do four. You can pick how many you do, but I do at least four, sometimes nine, because if you only got this one, you'd be like, well, this doesn't work. Do I run it again and get this one? Eh, you just do four, it's a better value. You end up with something you want. And then what I did is I changed it. I changed the queue to fast electric car, drag racing in the rain, and I got some pretty good results. That does look like a fast electric car. Maybe not drag racing, but racing in the rain. This tire appears to be the wrong size. Still pretty good. And for a thumbnail, that's pretty good. Not drag racing. Oh, what are you? I like it. It's a good one. Uh, that looks scary and a little bit haunted. But again, if you're going for four at a time, which again, I recommend four or nine, Four until you get a good handle on what the on what to type in. Let's look at the next one. Uh, then I modified it to, I took the same picture, this one, and I evolved it. There's an evolve button. And I evolved it into this and did fast car drag racing, red race car, day, fire, sunny day, fiery explosion. So we didn't get a red car. Oh, there's a red car, I guess. A uh, little bit of smoke, not really a fiery explosion, but they did get rid of most of the rain. So then I went to a much more advanced one, Starship on Mars next to a human colony, dramatic, bold, lightning, and then I clicked on artistic. It's one of the settings, which adds on things like portrait, 8K resolution, concept art, and it gets you some pretty cool stuff. Any of these for Spaceship on Mars next to a human colony, dramatic, bold, lightning, these are pretty good. Mix between the shuttle, the starship, and the ship from Futurama. I don't know. I mean, these are pretty good, man. Uh, that's a human colony. I don't know what it is, but I love it. Now, these aren't going to replace human designers just yet. On my channel, I'm not using AI instead of a human designer because I can't afford a human designer, and I don't have the time to wait for a human designer. I don't have somebody on staff waiting by. This is something I hope to get to. I would love to have a graphic designer that I can actually pay in the future. Budget doesn't yet support it. What coolness is this? All of these are just pretty darn good. And then, 
I wanted to redo one of the old failures. So let's look at some of the old failures. So this one I used with success. This one was uh, part of the chicken little, no, the sky is not falling. And it gave me some really good results. Chicken little is freaking out, full body portrait, 8K, the, and then everything from here down is automatically filled in when you click the artistic style that I chose. These are all quite good for Chicken Little freaking out. Cybertruck, Big Bold, and Beautiful Dramatic Portrait. These all came out pretty darn good, but they're not Cybertrucks. They're semis. And the whole reason I'm making this video was last week, when I showed these videos, someone in the chat was saying, we were, I was getting a lot of questions about how do you make it? How do you actually get AI to give you something that isn't junk? And I said I would go into it. This is beautiful, man. It's beautiful. It's not a Cybertruck. Beautiful, not a Cybertruck. Scary, I think that's a dude, not a Cybertruck. I love it. I love all of them. If you need something awesome, you can find it. If you need something specific, you might be out of luck. When I tried to do Tesla two-year anniversary, it gave me these nine images. These are useless. And this was DALI 2, or so it says. I just don't believe that Tesla two-year anniversary should ever produce Tell Dad 2. Okay, it does bad with lettering. But my gosh, the, how do you get 22 out of 2? I don't know. You got to have enough credits that you can keep trying. This was a neat one. This was a, a video I had it make. Tesla cars are awesome. And this is uh, about a 30 second loop maybe. And it gets weirder and weirder. This looks very AI. No one will mistake this for anything other than what it is. And I'm only holding on it so long because Nikola Tesla is right there. Terrifying. What else did we have in failures? This one I said, oh, give me uh, the style of professional photography. So it put in things like natural lighting, Canon lens shot on DSLR, and it gave me pictures of DSLRs and lenses. That's not helpful. And I had a bunch of failures like this. One that was interesting was Tesla driving off a cliff and blowing up. I only got one with a little bit of fire, a little bit of smoke, nobody really driving off a cliff. This guy backed into a cliff, maybe. And then just because I thought it'd be funny, I, I, I did Cliff Clavin driving a Tesla. And it did not, I mean, it got that Cliff Clavin's a, a, an older gentleman who may be a crab or have a missing leg or, uh, uh, or who drives a model that has a wing larger than the vehicle. Those are all very real possibilities. So I wanted to recreate with my best effort Tesla driving off a cliff and blowing up. So I typed in Tesla driving too fast, veering off a cliff, dramatic, bold, lightning, portrait, and then all the things that automatically fills. And we got some pretty interesting stuff. Uh, the distortion on the side of the car kind of makes that one not usable. That's not usable at all. Uh, that's cool. I don't know what car that is or what, I don't know what's going on. That's just, these are all, again, just so beautiful. There's a, there's a, there is a Tesla in this picture, technically. This one is gorgeous. This would make a fantastic poster for your kids. If you, because, you know, what kid doesn't love uh, red lightning and dramatic with oversized wheels on a 2012 Model S? Uh, I'm not sure what this is. This is pretty good. This one, boy, this one you could use. This one you could use if your subject is a Tesla driving off a cliff. Now, I was saying the stock is falling off the cliff, but trying to combine metaphors doesn't always work. And you could also go with a creepy ghoul uh, perched atop your Tesla. Hey, look at that. Even his reflection is there, but it kind of looks like his reflection is a car. But let's create something this time. How about Tesla Roadster so fast that it actually flies. That might work. And then we could add bold, dramatic, lightning. Those have worked well for me. And then add modifiers. Look at this. Different styles you can choose. Do not choose photo. It'll put in keywords like Canon and lens and you'll only get pictures of cameras. 
<laughs> so don't do that. You know what? We'll do an artistic portrait and then we'll come back and do it again as one of these other styles. So we'll do artistic portrait, remove the part that says head and shoulders, because that'll just confuse it. I don't want a head or a shoulder. Done. Square is fine. Four is fine. We'll go low res, even though it's a little more. Two credits. Let's go. And it takes, oh, depending what you ask it to do, 10 to 30 seconds. At times of high use, it could be more. Oh, okay. So this, eh, but this, now we're talking. That is absolutely usable. I, I could use this. I could use this. This, usable, gorgeous. It's like the Roadster, except a little bit sexier and more bold and more dramatic. Oh, for crying out loud, that was an unmitigated success. Let's do it again. Let's do a different one. Lightning. Yeah. And now we'll choose a different modifier. CGI, no. Cosmic, oil painting, candy. I've had bad luck with that. Let's do oil painting by James Gurney. Let's see. Let's see what we get, baby. This could work. And create. It's always hit and miss, my friend. Let's see what we get. And this should only take, because it's the middle of the night, at 10.42 p.m. It's pretty good. I still like the other one better. I guess you could use that. You could use that. Oh, sure. Sure. No driver in it. Unless this is uh, old OG Roadster. That's not bad at all. That does look like a pretty good oil painting of an OG Roadster with lightning. All of these came out, man. We'll do one more. We'll try the same prompt, but with Dolly. Dramatic, bold, lightning. Let's do Sinister. All right. Thumbnail, medium res. Mm -hmm. Four images. Let's do it. Oof. My expectations are low because I have had really mixed luck with Dolly 2 on this platform. I don't know if it's actually Dolly 2 or if it's a recent version. Yeah, see, these are... These are trash. No. No. I mean, you could use this one, but I wouldn't. So I would stick with Stable Diffusion. I did make, I've made so much stuff. My kids asked me to make a hot dog so big it's frightening, and that came out not very frightening. I've, uh, stock Traders, the same hot dog. Endless Cars Park. A robot couple sharing a quiet moment at sunset after working 50 days straight in the salt mines. How cool is that? That worked. I tried to do some robot ones. A robot building another robot. Gorgeous. So gorgeous. Mm, I don't see another robot being built. A robot hard at work building another robot that's even more sophisticated. That's terrifying because I was making videos about the bot. The Tesla bot. Two robots fixing each other, wires and screws to make them both better. <coughs> uh, you can see why I should have done four or maybe nine images instead of just one. There was one more I was going to show you. This is a bonus. This is a bonus. You've probably tuned out if you're on the main channel. Oh yeah, let's do that. Let's tune you out if you're on the main channel. A uh, quick thanks to my patrons who get early access, bonus content, and ad free experience, all that good stuff. Well, there it is, and there you go. If you enjoyed this, uh, consider watching the full 30-ish minute version over on the second channel, My Tesla Live. That's where we do the live stream every Friday at 7 p.m. and a podcast with Bear from Bear's Workshop every Tuesday at 4 p.m. Pacific. So, what did I miss or misunderstand? Leave me your thoughts, your wisdom, your juicy brilliance into them in the comments below and stay tuned, stay juicy, and I simply cannot wait to hear from you clever robots on the flippity-flop.